Hello, and welcome to this update of Say It Anyway. Hopefully by me saying it anyway, it helps you say it anyway, or think it anyway, or experience it anyway. Just remember the things that you think and feel are, are normal. You may not want them to continue, you know, especially if it's like depression or anxiety. Um, you may not want to be experiencing that all the time, but it's normal that you are, okay? It is not you that is weird. It is not something about you being broken. It's not anything about your character that makes you not good enough or makes these things happen that are bad. It, it is partially just because that's a part of the human condition and especially in the era that we're living in, in constant, constant worry, constant comparison, constant technological updates. The reason why I'm recording this one right now is because I want to remind everybody something that I want to remind myself, which is that things aren't suddenly all different just because you didn't get an update. So I'm this person that like, if I didn't hear from somebody, if I didn't get a response, or I haven't had a show in a couple weeks, I, I suddenly think that I, I can't do anything. I suddenly feel like like I have no following or, or that nobody cares or that there's not been a support system that I've had this entire time. And it's not true. I, 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 you know, when I was younger, just because I didn't talk to my friends on the phone that day, I didn't suddenly assume that we weren't friends anymore. You know, just because I, I hadn't heard from somebody in a little while or just because I was away for summer and then I came back to school, I, I, I didn't assume that they suddenly hated me or that, that things didn't work out. But when it comes to our constant contact or social media, you know, we, we have this thought that like, oh, they must hate me now because they're ignoring me. Like, no, people are doing their own stuff. And like, I, I just, like I get in my own head and then I think everybody is where my brain is. You know, so if I'm feeling self-conscious, I'm feeling like everyone else in the world is understanding that they're self-conscious or that I am self-conscious. They can see that on me. They can, they can see that I don't feel like the same person I used to be. Recently, I've been uh, coming to terms with the fact that I, I was a very pushy person. I was very self-centered and very Adam-centric and I would you know, very much make things about me and, and, uh, and I've, I've been trying to make it about other people and other things. And um, I think the old me would be bragging about the things I've done. Like, oh, I donated blank or I helped blank with blank. Like the old me was really happy about being able to brag about ways I was helping. And then this time I kind of feel bad doing that. So I'm not gonna do that, I think. I don't know, I may. But I've been coming to terms with it, so I've been really self-conscious. And now I'm thinking back about the relationships I've had with other people and feeling bad about some of the ways in which I acted. And then when those people come to me, I'm under the understanding that they're where my head is and that they're judging me too for my past behaviors, when really, that's not what's going on. They're just saying hi. They're just talking to me. They're still in my life, so there's obviously something about me that they liked or there was a way in which we connected or maybe it wasn't all bad. But I lose that confidence because I, I'm, I'm judging my old self and I'm coming to terms with how my new self is going to, to, to change my interactions with others. So it made me really afraid to, to talk to people that I haven't talked to in a while. It made me afraid to talk to some of the business contacts that I've had in the past, but I need to understand that like, no, 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 no. It's okay to show your new self to people. You should do that. You should. Um, you, if, if, if you've developed in any way, if you've learned something, if you've become more okay with yourself, you should definitely show that to other people. And don't don't think like, oh no, everything, all the previous relationships are so bad, or now that I recognize this, that they're, 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 they've all gone to shit. That's not the case. So just, uh, don't try to think for people. Remember that not everybody is where your head is at the time, and 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 never be afraid to show how you've changed in a positive way. Okay, I think that's good. That's good enough for now. Thank you for watching and listening. I love you.